A News 13 crime alert tonight after an 18-year-old woman eating lunch in her car is held at knife point. It happened in Waynesville, and the man police say is responsible is still on the run. They're asking people to be on the lookout for 24-year-old Bradley Reese. They think he may be hiding somewhere in Asheville. News 13's Kimberly King is live in Waynesville. And Kim, what do we know about Bradley Reese? Tammy, police tell us that he was recently released from prison after serving time in South Carolina for strong armed robbery. We have still pictures of surveillance video, and the police say it was just before he got into a victim's car brandishing a knife. These are still pictures, surveillance photos from inside the Waynesville McDonald's, where police say Bradley Scott Reese was seen minutes before he got into a woman's car in a parking lot two stores down. The victim was extremely traumatized by this event. Lieutenant Chris Chandler is speaking for the victim, too traumatized to tell her story on TV. She was absolutely scared out of her mind. All she could see was the knife in his hand. And the 18-year-old victim was sitting in her driver's seat eating her lunch when she saw Bradley Reese behind her car. He had walked over, she told police, from McDonald's. She tried to lock her car, but she wasn't fast enough. Bradley Reese got in the back. He was quicker than she was. The suspect ordered the victim to drive down the main drag and then into frog level, then into this gravel lot. Across the street is the Open Door Mission, where staff tell News 13 Reese came for several meals the week before. 19-year-old Kelsey Alexander looked with us at the suspect's picture she didn't recognize. It's not really safe anywhere anymore, honestly. Makes you feel less safe in your own town. It is a little unnerving, but I do think that people need to just really be aware of their surroundings, be aware of what you do, especially as a woman in locking your car. Police believe Reese may still have on the red shorts seen in these photos. They are tracking him. We know that he has spent time in Waynesville. We know that he has spent time in Bryson City. Uh, and we know that he has spent time in Asheville. And the investigation has led us to believe now that he is somewhere in the Asheville area. Now, this is Russ Avenue. This is the main drag into Waynesville and is just down this road in a parking lot where this alleged incident took place. Reese is now wanted on two felony charges, breaking and entering a car and second degree kidnapping. If you see him in Asheville or in the area, you're asked to call Waynesville Police at 828-456-5363. Reporting live in Waynesville, Kimberly King, News 13.